Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Uh, thanks for hanging in there. It's been a while since I posted. Uh, so today I'm going to do a review of uh, Venom 2, the Venom Let There Be Carnage. I just got out of the theater uh, watching that. And just uh, heads off, I want to say this was a really fun movie. Uh, it's If you've seen the first Venom, this is pretty much uh, picks up where the first one uh, left off. Uh, pretty much everyone's back in their role. Uh, Tom Hardy is obviously back as Eddie Brock. And this one continues... The dynamic of the first movie where you had the interplay between him and Venom. Also, they're sharing the same body. He's seeing his, uh, you know, Venom is a symbiote and he should to inhabit uh, Tom Hardy's body, Eddie's body. And so this movie gets more into that, uh, just doubles down on that first movie where it's a dynamic between them and, you know, have like arguments between them, say, hey, what are the rules? Obviously, Eddie's rules that you can't eat people and Venom wants to. And, uh, this one I just I just love because the interplay between it and this is this movie just it is so much ups to craziness. Um, and then of course uh, Woody Harrelson is uh, Cletus Cassidy. Uh, he's a victim killer who gets a symbiote uh, from Venom and then becomes Carnage, uh, the main uh, the main villain. So uh, it's and then of course and Michelle Williams is also back in her role as uh, Eddie's ex, um, and then uh, husband. So like pretty much the pretty much the same cast. Uh, that was back, except for the addition of, of Harry Woody Harrelson as the new villain. Um, this one just really ups to craziness. And it's funny, it's a really short movie. It's only 90 minutes. Uh, so it feels like it goes by really quick. Um, so it does feel like a lot of the scenes feel like they're kind of hurried a bit. Yeah, I mean, it could have been, the movie could have been a little bit longer. Yeah, it could have been like, you know, 10, 15 minutes longer. Maybe to let it breathe a little bit. But I really like that. If you liked the first Venom movie, you're going to love this one. I mean, this is... They said just doubles down on um, on the craziness, and I, in fact, I, I I personally found that I liked it better because there were there were some scenes in the first one I wasn't really a fan of, like the infamous like lobster scene in the in the restaurant. If you've seen the first movie, you know what I'm talking about. Um, so, and then there were and the fights were kind of dark. You couldn't really see what was going on in the first one. This one, I this I think it was more better drawn out, even though it was a shorter film, um, and I think the action was better. Interplay of the comedy was much better in this one. Like the like the comedy between him and Venom, and then and then of course Woody Harrelson brings a lot of comedy to it too in a very dark way. Um, so yeah, it's a pretty violent movie, but it's still PG thirteen, so there's no blood, there's not there's no gore or anything like that. So uh, you know, you, it's it's pretty much for most audiences. Um, so yeah, I really like this movie. It was it's quick, it's ninety minutes, um, so you're kind of in and out. Uh, so it is it does feel a little quick. I mean, it does feel a little bit rushed, but in the end, it, I think it was it was the right length. Um, you know, it's it was a really fun movie. Everybody just brings it like you said, Woody Harrelson's over the top in this movie. He's did a really good performance. You know, he's he's good at playing serial killers, what can I say? And um yeah, Eddie and then and Tom Hardy's really good, of course, is Eddie is kind of like this dual pay, trying to balance his life with Venom into it. And like you see how Venom just drives him crazy and how he has to bring and he, it really goes into their really delves into their relationship and you know kind of like how they're like got a bromance kind of going on whereas but they also drive each other crazy because you know venom has his needs he wants to eat people and eddie does not want that so uh he likes to have the interplay between them so it's a really fun movie a lot of good action violence of course um and it's really it's really fun and also be sure to stay for the mid credit scene there's a very important mid credit scene if you're you know been following all the you know the mc movies and you got to all the Marvel movies, you got to stay for the mid credit scene. So, um, anyways, so that's in a nutshell. Uh, was Venom Two, uh, called Let There Be Carnage. I highly recommend it. Of course, I'm a big fan of these movies. So, uh, if if you are into it, check, go check it out in theaters in theaters now. And thanks again, Winston Room, for uh, tuning in. Uh, like, share, and subscribe. Thanks so much.